Well, sure. What did you think? It was good. You know, main thing was just to you know, get back into it. Uh, throw pain free, nice and easy, and I was able to do that. Uh, you know, I just worked, had to work a kinks out a little bit in the first to uh, get the back out there again. And uh, try to settle down, sat back real well on my back leg, and uh, thought it was good. Threw some really good curveballs there, and uh, that was the main thing that was, that was going to be, you know, the test that I was good if I could snap off that curveball. What was your uh, pitch limit, and what did you end up from? Uh, we wanted to go with 5 or 75. Um, we ended up going 66. Uh, you know, kids are hacking down here. It's a, it's a different <laughs> game, but you know, I get it. And, you know, they want to they want to go out there and try and hack off me. You know, and try to you know get a hit off me. That's, that's okay. I was trying to use it to my advantage and uh, hit back hit backwards a little bit as the game went on, and uh, actually helped me out a lot to get some uh, real good work on my changeup. Does each strikeout give you more and more confidence when it's five minutes the innings go on? Uh, I mean, I'm just trying to trying to get through an inning, be efficient. Uh, you know, but. Sometimes when the strikeouts looking like that, kind of it gauges me a little bit on. Uh, you know, I know my curveball is going. I want to keep it sharp, so uh, you know, guys were giving up on it a little bit, and it was biting late. So that's all I wanted to do. What's next for you? What's the plan? I'm not sure. You know, uh, we're gonna go. I'm gonna head back and talk about it. But uh, you know, the plan or you know, I didn't want to uh, be out too long, and um, you know, just a little bump in the road and feel good right now. So hopefully, I can just go right back in. Do you feel like you're ready for that? Yeah. Go right back in? Yeah. You know, that was the plan. Uh, we wanted to take an aggressive approach uh, on it as soon as we found out that there was no da damage to the ligament. And I didn't want to take too many days off because I didn't want to lose everything that I had done in the offseason and spring mm -hmm. training to where I did it. I'd have to build all the way back up again. Uh, so that's why it was good to be able to still come out here and do five innings, 75. And, uh, you know, we were aggressive with it. And uh, we were just going to kind of gauge on if we need to take a step back or not or move forward. So everything was uh, good. I think he's good today, so I feel I'm ready to go. You don't think uh, what happened with Trevor May last night getting bumped that didn't change your uh, plans? Their plans for you? No, I don't think so. I don't think any of that. You know, when uh, when I feel like I'm ready to go, and you know, we'll be ready to go. What do you do? Uh, you know, you're you're a major leaguer, you're a veteran, and a Class A center fielder drops a fly ball. Did he say anything to you, or did you pat no, him on the he, back? No, or? he had a long way to run and. Um, honestly, I didn't think he was going to get there, but you know, the guy did a good job of dropping his head and getting back there and going to get that ball. And you know, those things are part of the game. So, you know, it's, it's, it's a, you know, and run and get it back. So, you know, not much you can do. The guy went out and sprinted as hard as he could and thought he thought he had a good beat on the ball and just kind of you know, maybe the wind or something just kind of dropped him. But uh, you know, I thought he did a good job. Anyway. So, uh, you know, rent an apartment here in Cedar Rapids? You keep coming back every year? Yeah, I don't. Uh, <laughs> I don't plan on doing that. Unfortunately, I didn't think I would. I would have to come back here, but uh, I do. And then, like I said, it was just a little bump in the road, and uh, you know, it feels good. And sometimes you start missing your body, and give it a rest, and you know, I'll be ready to go. How does, how does the big club look to you? What do you think the prospects are for the Twins this year? Oh well, we just gotta. You know, I think everything we saw, we saw, seen already early in the season. Uh, starting pitching kind of sets the tone. You know, whenever we go out there and throw, throw up a good start. You know, can't keep the team in the game in a lot of these ball games. So, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's the same like every other team, you know, the way it goes is uh, starting pitching in the ball game. So, uh, you know, we're making a conscious effort to try and get better and do that. And, uh, you know, we know we're going to hit and hitting coming around, things like that. So, you know, it just kind of starts with us. And as long as you give us a chance to win, I think we can win the ball game. So, if you wake up.